Wyoming Department of Transportation has been honored for their work over the past 20 years in reducing big game mortality on Wyoming highways. At an award ceremony this past spring, the Western Association of Fish and Wildlife Agencies noted YDOT's work over the past 20 years in designing and building innovative highway crossing structures. YDOT Rock Springs District spokesman John Eddins says the Nugget Canyon, Bags, and Trappers Point crossing structures in western Wyoming have reduced wildlife vehicle collisions by 85%. You know, the various treatments we can engineer and do to a highway to make it safer, we try to measure, you know, how much that's going to reduce crashes. And we can do different treatments, whether it be, you know, reconstruction to flatten a, a curve in the road or widen the road. And those treatments, though effective, you know, we usually don't get a crash reduction of, of 80 to 85 percent. In 2001, YDOT built Wyoming's first ungulate crossing structure in Nugget Canyon under U.S. Highway 30 near Kemmerer. Six more underpasses and six and a half miles of deer-tight fencing were then built, enabling over 13,000 mule deer to now migrate safely under that stretch of highway. In 2009, YDOT constructed a second series of underpasses on U.S. Highway 789 north of Bags. Today, 6,000 to 8,000 mule deer use those underpasses to move under the highway each year. Steve DeCecco is the Game and Fish Department's Regional Wildlife Supervisor in the Green River region. The benefit is, is purely to the Wyoming public in general, but specifically to Wyoming sportsmen because it's really uh, uh, saved a, an important portion of, our, of these populations, specifically these populations that migrate to and from winter range every year. And so we are seeing a, a really a, a positive effect on uh, the overall population of mule deer in both of these areas. The Trappers Point overpass project near Pinedale was completed in 2012 with two overpasses, six underpasses, and several miles of deer-tight fencing. It provides safe crossing for mule deer and pronghorn along U.S. Highway 191. The overpasses have proven vital to pronghorn. They provide safe movement on a major migration corridor across a major highway. Data from last fall shows the project allowed passage of at least 8,000 mule deer and pronghorn, essentially eliminating vehicle collisions on that highway. The projects reflect the work the Wyoming Game and Fish Department, YDOT, other wildlife organizations, and federal agencies are doing to build safer highways and conserve Wyoming's wildlife resource. A nice combination for sure. This is Ray Hageman with the Wyoming Game and Fish Department.